Hello everyone, T-Man978. The guy you don't know until I put up an action figure hunt. Oh, I'm in Target because my friends have been seeing Transformers Earthrise. The ones that actually live in Merlin. Click like. It's going to be a long shot, but you never know. I don't think they had these last time I was here. And they play these same damn songs every time. Yeah. I'm not saying Earthrise. I don't know if I should give them a DCPI. Yeah, I did see him. I would like to see Green Lantern. I mean, Green Arrow. But. Uh, Disappointment. What the heck? This looks like it's decorated for Christmas. Oh man, I can't win in this thing. I said they got songs playing in multiple speakers, different songs. Well, guess what? I'm in another Target, and look what I see when I walk through the door. Whoa, Nelly. That's going to make women want to buy bathing suits. But let's get to these toys. Or action figures, sorry. I hunt for action figures. Pay attention to these. You'll see why in the future. Ah, uh, yeah. I still didn't buy these two, or this guy. Because I don't really care about the Windigo. Um, Transformers, I'm seeing robots that I already own. Yeah. I don't own Clobber. Clobber is decent. I don't own this guy either. I hear he's the best one, but yeah. Did y'all see the new Constructicons? The last two? They look awesome. Hmm. 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 Oh, this is looking like a waste of a trip up here. Because this store doesn't have a big action figure section. And most of the stuff I want. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, man. This is one of those bendy figures, but I actually like the way this looks. That, that's pretty much perfect, except his nose. Let's zoom in on that nose so you can see what I'm talking about. The pain is missing. But, man. But with the bendable, the bendable body, that ensures that he'll always look right and not have any exposed joints and whatnot. I don't know. I can't believe I want that. Dr. Eggman is super iconic, and I love Sonic the Hedgehog. Like I said, small action figure section. They merged this Hot Wheels section with the Star Wars area. So, Power Rangers and Junk is limited. They don't have any Overwatch. And I was shocked to see the Fortnite dudes. They have a whole bunch of Lego stuff on clearance. Um, Star Wars stuff. This should probably be uh, Mandalorian. But it's not. I think Mandalorian is number 92. Man, I can't believe this target is immaculate. There's a, even a dude down there putting like the finishing touches on the shelf. But the one right down the street looks like garbage. I got people from the UK like embarrassed for me. They're like, they think all of the US stores look like garbage. 
If anyone from Target wants to know where I'm talking about, I'm talking about the one in Pikesville, Maryland. I don't care. It looks like trash. Target Pikesville. On Rice's Town Road. Well, um, I think these are new or something with soft goods. Uh, there's supposed to be another guy. Oh, I guess it's the other Pennywise. And they got some Nintendo Switch stuff. One clamps. Amiibo. Eh, same stuff. I'm not gonna kill y'all to death. Kill y'all to death. Fail. Damn, that is a big head for her. What the heck? That is weird. Yeah, that's that's weird. We still got Dark Samus. This is the Owings Mills one. Look at this. I've been wanting a Ren. So I can have Ren and Stimpy. Uh, I keep debating on whether I want one of them. So I'll see these mystery boxes. Somebody took the liberty of breaking the seal, so I opened them. Two of them are Tommy. That that up. If you got Tommy visibly available right there, who would want <laughs> another Tommy? And then, even though that's there, I think these things are freaking eleven. No, I don't know what price they are, but I know they're not five dollars. If they were five dollars, that would be reasonable. All right, real quick. I'm in Walgreens. I don't like shopping in Walgreens. Well, filming in Walgreens because they typically don't have anything. Like this store has been having the same infamous Iron Man forever. They got Ratchet Steel, so he's not rare. He's a Walgreens exclusive if you need one. They got these Diamond Select toys right here. First time I saw him, I didn't see Aang, but I've seen him several times now. They're only $17. They typically don't come with a lot. I think because these figures aren't like adult size figures, they come with an accessory. That does too. One little one. But yeah, no like special Marvel Legends section, like for the exclusives and whatnot, which always disappoint me. I have not been seeing like Emma Frost and whatnot, or uh, the step for cuckoos. I mean, I guess Doctor Doom over there, or infamous Iron Man, is an exclusive. But yeah, who cares? They do have this wall of summer store toys. I mean, and whatever is in these crates, which could be Marvel Legends, but I'll never know because they're in the crates. Alright folks, I'm in Towson. Movie Stop hasn't existed at this location for like four years or maybe more. And that sign is still glowing. But anywho, this location has the most toys, so yeah, let's see what they got. It's freezing cold outside. Well, they used to have the most, I don't know. But let's see what's here. These are out. Oh man. I want this. I wish she was smiling. I had some kind of expression. Oh, Raiden. Is it really $19? Oh, uh, let's see what if Target has Earthrise. I might have to come back. They got all those Batman Ninja Turtles. Hold on, this thing. The Bat Raptor. There are a couple reviews out for this thing. I'm not too concerned. It does look more impressive in person, though. Now all of this looks like Funko Pop, so I'm going to go in this direction. Uh, 
Yeah, all types of troopers right there. Ooh. These chicks, they not as, what the hell is this? Oh my God, the, what the heck? These are fully articulated. 20 bucks though, they're tiny. Tiny. They look like they have a Harley Quinn. What are these called? <laughs> I'm trying to get my phone to freaking focus on this. But they're four inch figures, three and three quarter inch looks like. I've never seen these before. But $20 though. <clears throat> they are cool and detailed. Damn, I wasn't going to come out here, but man, this store is better than any GameStop. Really, really close to me. They got Sagat right there. They got that $120 Batman right there. I don't know if the Harley, the Harley is probably just a statue, but that Batman is an action figure. They got that thing, whatever that is. They got Common Rider. Are these action figures? I think it's just a statue. Both of them. Well, let's see what's here. Yeah. If I don't see any Earth Rods freaking up in my... My, uh... What am I calling this thing? Budget. I'm only getting one $20 figure. $20 to $25 figure. Oh, yeah. Parts former found Leewig for me. And I need to get that from him. Nightwing, they're still the same price. She's two dollars more than she should be. Have you seen a new one? Yeah, I was just setting it up. Like, I mean, have you seen like video of it? Oh no, it's like the same game from back in '97, but like completely redone. So, certain stuff in there is regular price, but let me get to the target. The main things that are overpriced are the Marvel Legends that are successfully selling. So, yeah. Mortal Kombat seems to be still $20. Let me get to that target. Alright, now I'm in the target. They have their action figures right in the center. So, you can't miss them. And it'll be a miracle if I found anything cool in here. They got these power player things. She's on clearance for 10 bucks. I haven't seen freaking Jetfire in forever. Cogman, I haven't seen him. I've never seen I never saw a barricade outside of Walmart. And here are Earthrise MicroMasters. <sighs> Exciting. No deluxe class figures. They got this big ass kid, Optimus Prime. Um, Green Lantern too. And some Batmans. So 
I have found earth rise, but not what I was looking for. These are on Amazon right now. I'm going to put a link in the description. Every purchase you make after you click that link helps out my channel. And it helps me buy more stuff on these toy hunts. Fortnite stuff. Robux. Yeah. Yeah. Ooh, magic carp, carp, carp. WWE. WWE is like, either they don't like stocking it in stores or they sell quick. Their elite figures never stay on the shelf. Only the Beast Small Friends Blue Ranger. Damn. This right here actually looks like soft goods for 10 bucks. I see only Luke as far as Black Series. And nothing down there besides Toy Story. And I finally watched that movie. It was good. This area still has one of those Transformer section for Cyberverse. They have a Megatron and a Shockwave. I can't wait for them to release Wave 2. Jonesy. I'm going to scan him off camera. Maybe he's way cheaper. Maybe. Their NECA section in the store is all the way at the end. I'm going to let y'all walk with me because they have a nice little toy section right here. This is their little fake Toys R Us. Oh, reduced price. I think when the first movie, I didn't realize she was a porcelain doll. I also didn't realize she was a lamp. These two look real cool. And they are more expensive than they would be in real life. Somebody always has to be walking by with a cart. But they're in clearance. These things would be like freaking a dollar at a theme park. But, yeah. Yeah. I'm sorry if I'm in and out of focus. I'm trying not to be. But the camera isn't working with me today. Alright, here is the NECA and movie toy section. Mm, I see some Dragon Stars. One. Amigos. I don't really see any real real NECA stuff. Meh. 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 No turtles, no Rocksteady and Bebop or anything. Alright, I'm gonna go to the Walmart out here and... Oh, you know what? I think they have an Ollie's out here. Now, it wasn't open the last time I came out here. Oh, I'm in Ollie's and Ollie's always has... Well, not just Ollie's. There's always an awesome selection of Barbie stuff because... I don't think Barbie is selling like that. Mattel. I hope Mattel lasts because, yeah, I don't think I probably bought my daughter like one or two Barbies. If she had Barbies, it wasn't me buying them because she didn't care about them. But they do have some cool Mattel doll type stuff. And I'm going to slowly walk over to you. The, um,. Look at this camera here. Super articulated. Boy, oh boy. I'm trying to enjoy myself filming this stuff. People calling me, telling me crazy things. They got these Master of the Universe. I would assume Craig has her already. And yeah, Abby Yates. Don't nobody care about her. I got that.
Yeah, and I guess I better start talking because this music is playing a little bit loud. I don't have, I got some Marvel Mighty Mugs, but I don't have Transformers. And yeah, they're not going to trick me into getting it. But, um, yeah, it's not a real big action figure selection so far. Yeah, not big at all. And yeah, I'm going to get out of here. Okay, I'm in one of the only Walmarts that has an escalator in the middle of it. And the last time this door was good to me was like freaking 2005, 2006. But anywho, if you have a cart, you can put your cart in there and it rides with you. All the way upstairs. One day I seen these people, they had two toddlers. They let the toddlers get on the escalator before them. That almost, I swear that took five years off my life. First thing I'm saying is clearance. Let's see what's going on there. <laughs> they moved some of this um, Valentine's Day stuff over here already, which I don't care about that. Um, $2 Godzilla stuff. They got some Elsa hair. I mean, not Elsa, um, Anna. Uh, one step changer. Hmm. And yeah, that's about that. Wait, no. I got these. Two fifty. That is, that's she is definitely worth two fifty. You will not be disappointed. They got these things. I don't know what the hell they are. You can put them in the tub. You know what? I haven't been in this store since they started selling toys in the electronics section. I don't know what that's going to be like. If it's like anything. So far, all I'm saying is these Rick and Morty toys. They have this small, tiny selection of Funko Pop type stuff. The only thing grabbing my eye is Scarlet Witch right there. <sighs> yeah, I need that arm for Hulk. <sighs> I don't suggest people stealing, but when it comes to certain characters, I don't want them. I do feel kind of offended, though, that the two black characters in the wave are the ones readily available. I'm a little tiny bit offended by that. <laughs> Look at this. Three refractors, so everybody wanted to refract there a while ago. Megatron, they got these cartoon. Megatron and Optimus, there is a Springer back there. I'm honestly shocked to see those. I do see a Harley Quinn right there, McFarlane. These things again. A little tiny taste of Star Wars. And yeah. Yeah. Five Nights at Freddy's and Bendy and all that types of junk that only little kids care about. And now we're going down the stairs where that big obstacle is in my way. Maybe she'll be gone by the time I get down there. Yay. I'm lucky. Well, for closure's sake, I'm back in GameStop because I was debating on Batgirl or Raiden. Because it says $19 right there. Guess what? No. On Amazon, it's still 20 bucks right now. She's... $25 on Amazon right now and I'm debating because I took a big trip out here. Should I just walk out of here with this or should I stick to my guns and order it on Amazon? But yeah. It's cool to see this stuff in person but the prices are not cool. <laughs> not at all. $7 over retail and the guy just tried to tell me that all the prices on everything went up everywhere. Not true. 
Not sure. I didn't show this in detail, and I didn't show this in detail. All right, for closure's sake, I did pick up the Batgirl. I made a massive trip out here. <laughs> so for the convenience, or the, for the fact that it's actually here, and it's only $2 over retail, and I haven't seen her in any store, I picked it up. But that rating, disappointing. I'm not paying seven more dollars over retail than than the thing should cost. Like two dollars, okay, okay, since it's here. But seven, nah. Anywho, this is the only thing I bought. I think in this toy hunt or fig hunt, whatever I'll call this video. Thank y'all for watching. Until next time, T Man Nine Seven Eight out of here. Okay, bonus. That was gonna be the end of my footage, but I'm in this Walgreens. The right eight chains into Walgreens out here. And yeah, they do have this exclusive Doom Slayer. If you haven't seen this guy reviewed, I reviewed it. I see Hound and whatever the um, purple dude named Brunt. I see this guy. I see Vulture and three Stepford Cuckoos. If I would have came here first, I probably would have bought one more of them. Uh, uh, yeah. Three of them there. If you don't got any of these, they're here. Thank you for watching. Until next time, T-Man 978 out of here. Bonus, bonus footage. I'm now in McDonald's. I told, I was talking to Kevin, complaining about the, um, the prices in GameStop. And then when I was in Walmart, I mean Walgreens, I told him about these. He bought all three. He sent me enough money to buy these. And enough money to get dinner tonight. So, <laughs> thank you, Kevin Womack. I won't make fun of him for a week. This is the real end. Bye. Click, click the videos. Click the fucking videos, baby. Click, click the videos. You should really click these videos.